Hi, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. In today's SQL tutorial, I'll talk about a special customization for invoice for timber and glass industries. Now, for this customization, we divide the timber into three different categories or UOM, foot run, FR, pieces, PCS, and also tonnage ton. For foot run and also pieces, the amount is equal to quantity multiplied by price. This is the standard calculations. Customization happen for tonnage. The way to key in is open bracket 20 slash 10 comma 134 slash 14 close bracket slash 3 slash 4. 20 is stand for pieces, 10 is length, whereas 3 slash 4 is the size. The width is 3 and also the thickness is 4. All these variables can be changed. Let's look at an example. So we consider this whole part is section A and this is part A and part B. So as mentioned before, the sections A and B will sum up together and multiply by 3, multiply by 4, then it will have a hidden calculation of divide by 7200. Now, remember one more thing is all this variable can be changed, meaning that this section for section A doesn't always have only A and B. It can have A, B, C, D. Okay, so meaning that it can have 20 multiplied by 10, then 134 multiplied by 14, then 30 multiplied by 12. That will be a section C. So everything calculate, then you get a final answer 3.4600 we put it as four decimal point then this one is the quantity then there is another customization where the final invoice printout need to auto sum according to unit of measurement so let's look at the result so this is the sales invoice in SQL accounting system select customer address will come up automatically Invoice number is auto, date is auto, agent is auto, but still can change. Reference one, what I did is actually I put it as lorry number, extension number, I put it as PO number. Then at the note, at the more tab over here, I put it as the delivery note that appear under the invoice. Description as usual, this SU quantity is actually the total pieces. Example, 126 plus 3 plus 8 is equal to 137. This one user need to calculate manually, then put it over here so that it can appear under the total pieces column. The size. The size is actually second description. Remark 2 is the title. Okay, so when it auto sum up, this remark 2 where all the remark to is the same, then it will put under the same section. Quantity. So remember the 3.4600, it's automatic calculated. Whereas for foot run and pieces, user just key in accordingly, multiply by the unit price, then you get the total amount. So you can see that the result will auto sum. Let's look at the actual system. So in SQL, we go to sales invoice. You look at the way you key in is exactly like what I show you just now under the more tab, the note. So it's show over here. Manually sum up the quantity, put in the description, put in the remarks, second description, remarks to quantity UOM, unit price, get automatic total. This will be the lorry number, then extension number is the PO number. So I just preview. This is the customized invoice template. Then you get your invoice for timber industry or glass industry basically also use the similar calculations also. So of course, maybe for your company, you have a different way of calculations or different way of presentations. No worry you still can talk to me directly if you have this kind of requirements. So just in case you need any 
a special support, support or customization, you can contact me directly. Or you just want to purchase SKL accounting or sign up maintenance, you can contact me directly. Once again, thank you for watching. I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. Thank you.